Hi everyone, so this is part two as I have no idea how to edit the first one to just add this on. Um, so yesterday I um, dyed some um, organic bamboo velour and I tried a different method. Um, and like I said in the first video, I don't know if it's a new, well not new, but like, I haven't seen anybody using that method to do it so I thought oh well I'll try it anyway and see what, what I get so basically I used a toothbrush to splat paint it uh, paint dye all over the bamboo velour after I'd soaked it in soda ash and I have obviously left it rinsed it out washed it dried it so this is what I actually came out with which I am super happy with because it just looks I don't know, it just looks completely different. I don't know, it just looks... I think it looks a bit like a watercolour. Like, you can see where the fabrics have like run and... I don't know, I just think that's really pretty. It's all right, I'll give you like a bit of a closer up view. So yeah, I'm really happy with that. Um, the only thing I did use more like blues and greens in it as well, but they don't seem to have taken um, to it as much. You can see like the yellow and the red, the orange and the purple, but for some reason the blue and the, the green haven't really stuck as much. Maybe they needed more time to develop, I don't, I don't know, but you can see the odd speck of blue in it, but it just majority this seems purple but what I also did was um, after I splattered like flipped all the dye onto it I hung it on the line and obviously that's where I've got like the runs down the fabric but I actually quite like that effect so I'm really really super happy about that and how that's turned out so this will be getting made into some lovely pads soon so uh, I'll pop down my link anyway to my Etsy store so keep an eye out for um, the pads that I make with this um, so yeah but thank you for watching bye